Now anytime I'm about to make changes to my database like the tables, the forms, reports, and so on, and I'm not quite sure about these changes, what it'll do, well, you can make a backup of the database, so if it does get messed up, then you can go ahead and revert to your backup. It's really simple. Just come up here, click on the Office logo button, go down to Manage, and click on Backup Database. Click on it. It opens up the Save As file. It gives you the default name. It says, OK, the original name of your database is Table Analyzer, but we'll put in today's date as the backup, as well as the original name of your database. So all I have to do is click Save, and it's done. Now, when you click Save, unlike other Microsoft programs like Word and Excel, it doesn't open back up in that new saved or backed up database or document or spreadsheet if it was Excel or Word. Up at the top, it still leaves me in my original database. So that's cool because then I can just go right into messing around with my database. So if I make an oopsie, and this is the name Table Analyzer, then I can say, oh, that was bad. I can close out of here. Remember, I backed it up to my exercise folder. There it is. There's my original database, Table Analyzer, and this is the backup with today's date. So then all I have to do is right click to delete the Table Analyzer and send that away, and then right click on the backup and rename it and say, you know, just get rid of the date there, and then hit enter. And now it looks like my original database without the date there. And then just double click to open it back up, and there's all my objects. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel, get notified of the latest videos, and for only $2 a month, you can have access to all my Microsoft Office training videos.